that one quick stream restart later to fix my frozen camera and we should be live again. Someone pipe up in the chat room when you hear me. Can you hear me? Test, test, one, two. Am I live again? I'm moving. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. It's the third problem in as many days with OBS that I've had. I don't think this latest update is entirely stable. Hey, T Dog. How you doing? Skyforger. How you doing? Good. We are apparently once more on the lines. Ow. Oh, I've got a little ingrown hair back there or something. Ow. Uh, doing good. Eating a mint. Also, Twitch is still broken. Still keeps saying welcome to the chat room. Might have to relog or something. Yeah, relog might be the best option if it's. It, it, it won't, won't recognize you as inhabiting the chat room. So it's it's already. I'm already. It's already hot. It's very muggy in here, especially after I took my shower this morning. But I'm terrified to open the window because of all the smoke and the heat pouring in. Actually, today's high is not too bad. I'm going to take a quick peek out the window, see how smoky it is out there. Because if I can open a window for some breeze, I would rather do that. Thank you very much. Oh yeah, it's not too bad out there. That's not going to happen. Get a little natural breeze in here. Oh yeah, it's making a difference already. Uh, finally get around to playing Dragon Quest Builders 2, and it's a blast. Told you so. Told you so. Did you try the uh, extended demo, or have you just flat out bought it? Back in Minecraft today. Apparently Twitch is doing a buggy thing, because I... Where are the, we're, we're, we're having that issue again, where... Maybe it's just, maybe it's just the time of year. The last, the last few Minecraft streams, we've been missing a, f a whole bunch of the regulars at the start of the year. Maybe it's a daylight savings thing. I used to kick it off with more you here on the on the Minecrafts, on the crafting of mines. Oh well. Watched the uh, second Lego movie last night. Finally got around to it as it appeared on Netflix. Not nearly as good as the first one. Still pretty good though. Made me laugh out loud a few times, so that's all you really want from it. I am playing Akiv. The fuck is Akiv? I think like six years later. Oh, unless that's Assassin's Creed 4? <laughs> Possibly Assassin's Creed 4, not Akiv. I don't know. Um, I think it's fixed. Reloaded. I think we're all good now. Hooray! Is that our screen? Okay. Righty-o. Oop, oop. Turn the camera back, thank you. So, back in Minecraft today. Minecraft Sunday as it is. After a couple of days of doing nothing but building Lego on stream. Oh, and also not, not just Lego, but also Nanoblocks, of course, but we, we, we don't speak about the Nanoblocks. If you missed the Nanoblocks rage stream, well, it's not really rage, but frustration stream. Uh, I prioritized that when I put it up straight away yesterday, because I know... Was it UT Dog who, uh, who was gasped wanted to see that? Because you turned up late yesterday, you wanted to see the Nanoblock one? It was one of the regulars. I bet Avic's a thing now, I'm copywriting that. You mean Akiv? Avic? Akiv? I don't know. Hey Anthony, how you doing? So, uh, I did a little bit of work off stream last night, after I watched the Lego movie. And got the uh, sorting system figured out. Or well, the, the filtering, not really sorting system, but the filtering system to pull the fish out of the stream of the new Ocean Monument farm. And I built a basic bamboo farm over there to fuel cooking the fish, but it is not nearly efficient enough. So one of the things we're going to do today is build a buttload more bamboo farm so we could properly fuel all the fish cooking. 
because I just can't keep up right now. The other thing I did, uh, I did this this morning actually, just before I started streaming, is I popped onto the YouTubes and Googled uh, or searched um, how to do a, uh, what's called a Jeb door, which is an invisible piston door. So I've set this up, hit that switch. There we go. Pulls back, opens up, pushes forward, closes in. So we finally have our Pokeball without the gap in it. So we'll just hit that, walk on in, and we're in a little, little chamber of horrors here with all the heads. Um, ooh. Ooh. We are starting off strong today, Scott Kedre coming in with 10 to 24, dinging on that digital alert. This will be a good one. Wait, wait for the text to speech on this one. I'm a scat man. <laughs> Sounds more like speaking in tongues. <laughs> I had to actually rebuild this door twice. The first tutorial I used, they didn't mark it properly in the description of their video, uh, but it only works on bedrock and console versions. Whereas, because of what's known as quasi-connectivity, Redstone works a bit differently in Java. It's a bug that they refuse to take out because too many people rely on it for making contraptions like this. This, the, the build, I can't, I can't actually show you the Redstone, it's all hidden and buried away. But this, this particular Redstone doesn't work on Bedrock Edition and vice versa. The tutorial I followed was the wrong version. Apparently the, the Bedrock version of Redstone works the way it was intended to work, but of course, as I said, because so many people rely on quasi-connectivity in various redstone builds in Java, they can't take it away, otherwise people will riot! Right, off to the gravesite we go. Get Skull Kid. A shiny new gold block. Love look at your Minecraft. Which resource pack to use? This is uh, Lithos Core. Uh, if you type in exclamation point MC in the chat, Mubot will serve you up a nice little fat list of the shader, the texture pack, and any other sort of tweaks I've made. Like I use a little data pack to make the trees look nicer as well. That's not part of resource pack. That's a separate data pack. There you go. G Dog nailed it. Um, and when you it gets updated to 1.15, it's all going to get a shit. Yeah, I, I, as far as I know, that redstone is still going to work in 1.15. I don't think they've done any redstone patching in 1.15, but maybe, maybe one day they will eventually fix that bug. And all the redstone Minecraft people are just going to have to fucking deal with it. Uh, good day, Trans Whisperer. <laughs> Alright, I think we still need a couple of more. Anyone else's stream just die? Uh, my downstream is still coming through on the MacBook. So someone tell Ray might want to refresh. I'm going to wait till they confirm that they're back in the stream before I place their block because Adoy. Just gonna have a super duper good looking view right here. Actually, how's my frame rate looking these things? Yeah, we're kind of just now to that 30 right there. Do I have VSync turned on? I do have VSync turned on. Okay, which means I could probably pump that render distance out a couple more chunks and still maintain 30 with the new shaders. Ooh, down to 17 for a sec there, we'll be loading. You'll see how that goes. You back yet, Skull Kid? Yeah, the, uh, the new version of the ray tracing shader is a little, little more efficient. 
So let's see if we can get away with pumping that few distance out. Got them a twitch, give me a sec. No worries. We got time. Get the world to load in. That's one thing I'm looking forward to being able to upgrade to 1.15 for the uh, the new world rendering. It's much more like Bedrock in that it fades in nice and elegantly rather than this chunka 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 chunk thing. But because Optifine is not available for 1.15 yet, it means I can't run my ray tracing shader, which means I'm not interested in upgrading it. Can someone type exclamation point Twitch in the chat? My nuts stuck again. I keep, I've, I've, I've been saying for a month and a half now, I need to replace this globe with a good Philips one so it doesn't get stuck, but... Whatever. I have audio, no video, Cisco Kid. That's interesting. How odd. Why do you always have so many problems with this stream? Which, which god did you wrong? Is everything you build around the base? So you have other sub-bases in the world. Mostly it's around base, but there are other bits and pieces in the world. Like the stuff we're working on today is becoming a sort of mini base in its own right. It was never intended to be that, but it's just becoming that by virtue of I keep doing stuff over there. We'll talk about that when we get there. Uh, do you have vision yet? Can I put your block on your skull? <laughs> yeah, Loki. The trickster god. Ooh. It's rendering my player shadow all the way down there, too. I don't think the shadows reached that far in the previous version of this shader. That's pretty cool. to see what people do with the Void Export in Pokemon Sword and Shield. Yeah, at the moment it's just a novelty, but I bet you there's some sort of trick that that'll fall into to dupe or do some other more destructive hacking. I haven't tried it myself yet, though. I'm reboot my Mac. It's just my Mac. All right. We'll wait. The uh, chatting portion of the stream is kind of short today anyway, so we can, we can wait for people to turn up while we wait for Skokit to reboot. <clears throat> Actually, while we wait, because that'll take a minute or two, we'll just keep, take a quick trip over to the Iron Farm. So I did uh, fix that and redistribute the villagers, which is a pain in the ass. I had to build a little bridge between the two villager pods and then try to herd the villagers across and cram them in boats and it's just, oh, seriously, it was so annoying. But I got it done and I glassed them up a bit more securely so hopefully if they did get pinged by villager arrows it's not going to happen again. Uh, video, yay! Do you have audio as well? Where are you going? Oh, I thought it was going to take you longer to reboot. I was just going to check on the iron farm. Don't panic. That was a, that was a quicker reboot than I was anticipating is all. Yeah, I'll snatch that. Alright, now let's go place Ray's block. fast even for four years old. Well, I mean, sometimes reboots take longer than others because it's doing stuff. Quite frankly, my Mac has such solid uptime, I almost never reboot the damn thing unless it needs an uh, update. I think I've had uptime on the, on the MacBook of 45, 60 days sometimes. 
and even then, again, I only ever update it for the sake of, or uh, re uh, reboot it for the sake of installing an update. Skdoink! There we go, at last! Respect, COD! Thank you very much, Kokid Ray. We continued! Ridiculous generosity. I really have to reboot my PC? Oh, I, no, I reboot my PC way more often. Just fucking Windows. There's always something going wrong I need to reboot for. Hey, Star Sapphire, how are you doing today? Then, oh, we're in night time again. Spooky times. So I heard you the trans <laughs> yeah, apparently. <laughs> apparently I'm the trans whisperer. Oh, oh, I saw you. Get the better of me today, Mr. Creeper Face. Let's go up, Mart, though. Nope. Do I have hostile sounds turned off? Mm -hmm. Let's turn that back up so I can actually hear them coming. Ooh, Jesus. What was that noise? So, do I have anything that he's doing in the town here before I go back to the Ocean Monument? Oh, I know. I'm going to take some of this with me just to supplement our current fuel supplies over there. So let's go over, take stock of what's happened and what we need to do next. Still haven't built a new adventure box, no. Here, I'll show you. Actually, I'll show you the front first so we can get a glimpse of what's going on here. So, I forgot when we built this, I had a whole style of sounds turned off. <laughs> we weren't hearing the squishy squish, but now we can. So, um, standard sort of bamboo farm, observer piston arrangement. Five is not enough. We're getting our cooked fish coming through. Because as they die up there, they filter through down. Oops, we'll go this way. Down to a standard item filter arrangement that you see in all sorts of uh, 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 sorting systems and whatnot. I'm not going to explain to you how it works because, frankly, I suck at redstone and I'll probably get it done. But you can you can you can YouTube search how this thing works. But yeah, this is set up to filter the fish as it comes through. So I've got all the drops coming through into one chest up here. This hopper is part of the filter system. So that pulls out the fish. Everything else that gets collected in this box, as you're seeing there, bloop, 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 goes into the regular storage down here. 
which is where we collect all the drops from the farm. I really wish we would get more squid drops. Uh, so yeah, pretty, pretty straightforward split filter system. No filter on this side because we don't need it, but we filter out the fish to feed into, through here, into the smoker. Smoker is fueled by the bamboo and cooks our raw cod, which then gets dumped into the chest we saw out front. And just while I'm here, like I said, I'm going to supplement. Our fuel supply. Can I reach one of the other? I don't think I can reach one of the other ones. I'll do. But yeah, one of the things we have to do today is vastly expand our uh, cane production. Because we're getting way backlogged on the amount of fish in the system. All these feeding hoppers are all chocked up. I mean, it's making more than enough fish to keep us fed, but it's getting sh so backlogged that fish are starting to filter through the filter system itself. Like the filter itself is clogged up. So the fish have no choice but to go in here now. Um, after this, you won't ever go back to Bedrock, will you? I don't know. Bedrock is going to have the RTX ray tracing shaders, so there's a draw there at least. Do you at least have flint and steel sachets in case you quarter breaks? Sure do. At least I think I did. I should have. Pretty sure I do. Yep. There's one on the other side as well. So, uh, did that make sense to you guys? So we got the Guardian Farm up top here. I'll go show you that from the top in a second. But that kills the fit, all the Guardians. The drops filter through the pipes. So that uh, the, all, all the drops from the Guardian Farm filter through into that hopper there, which goes into this temporary box here. This box has two hoppers coming out of it. One of the hoppers is part of the filter system, so this is designed just to pull cod through this way. All everything else goes through this hopper and gets pumped. Why did I loop it back that way? I forget why I did that. I guess I was trying to do something else. It doesn't need to be like that. I can simplify that. Um, but all the other drops go into the standard chests here. For our prismarine needs. The filter system here, which is this little redstone contraption, pulls all the fish out, which then feed into the cooker, or smoker, which is fueled by the bamboo farm on the other side, because bamboo you can use directly as fuel. Four sticks of bamboo cooks one item. Does that make sense that time? Um, I see you have effects on you. Yeah, oh yeah, we had a a beacon set up while we were building this because. Uh, I needed resistance and regeneration because I was getting laser beamed by the guardian fish while trying to build the actual farm itself outside. I just haven't taken the beacon down yet. Item sort of scare me. Me too. Which is why I hardly ever use them. Oh, look, it's going down. So I barely understand how they work. So I tend to avoid item sorters because when they break, I'm never quite sure how to fix them properly. But that single module of item sorting is pretty easy to deal with because it's not sorting into an entire storage system. It's just one item. So it's easy to keep track of. So yeah, we have a little AFK spot up here. Uh, and this is a special no-drain guardian farm. So we come to the AFK spot to try and control the spawns into the middle there. You still get the occasional pack spawn outside, but that's fine. 
Uh, top part of the middle of the Guardian Farm is covered in soul sand, which makes a bubble stream, which pushes them up into inward flowing water, which then pulls them down into the kill chamber, which is campfires. And that is ridiculously easy to make. This is the easiest Guardian Farm I've ever made. And as you can see, it is repulsively efficient. So many spawns. No, I, I didn't get the creeper. I was going to build a creeper spawner up here, but I did I did a bunch more experiments making spawn platforms and all crap like that, and it just turns out that... Uh-oh, look out, we got a dolphin trapped in the system. Nope, he escaped. Uh, yeah, it just turned out that because of the rates down there in the farm, there's just not enough mob cap open to let anything spawn up here. So I might make a creeper spawner... Uh, outside of its range. Is it? Oh! I didn't realize we were that, that close to the... Oh wait, no. I was thought that was the Paradise Island, but no, that's the iron farm over there. I've just pushed the render distance out. Uh, but we should be pretty close to the Paradise Island somewhere around here. I forget which direction it's in. Anyway. Uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll probably branch out from here, maybe in that direction or something, and get far enough away to stop the spawns here but still make a creeper spawner up in the air above the ocean, seeing as we've already built this high. But that's a job for a different time. What attracts them to the middle? Um, there's actually a water stream above the level of the ocean. So you've got ocean level, and then I built a water stream above that, flowing water into the center. Tough to show you. Um, I mean, I can get, I can go down there, but then I'd have to swim back to base to get back anywhere. But if you go to the Discord, I think in the general chat, I did link to the tutorial that I used to make that farm. So if you watch that tutorial, it might make a lot more sense to you than me trying to describe it to you. But basically, yeah, there's water flow above the standard ocean level. Just like you would use water flow in a regular mob trap. Where am I going? Oh, I suppose we probably need more materials for the bamboo farm for a start anyway, so... Watching you squirm, trying to explain things. <laughs> I've always said I'd make a lousy teacher. Right. Uh, let's go grab a shovel box. Now then, I am going to need some more dirt. I'm pretty sure I didn't leave any behind. I need extra building blocks, but we've got all the prismarine over there. I need... How much? 17 pistons. I'm probably going to need more pistons. Just trying to remember where I needed redstone dust for that design. I've already forgotten. Pretty sure I don't, but I do need observers. I need 19 of those, though, so I need more observers. Where's my redstone? Man, I have just burned through my redstone. So, quartz and cobblestone. Well, I think we need to go get more quartz. I seem to have burned through it all. Okay, so we're going to do this in stages today. First mission is quartz. What do you get 
from that sea farm. Um, Prismarine materials, which makes you, uh, the, it lets you make the various materials that the ocean miners ma are made of. So those green prismarine blocks. But mostly I want those farms because you can make sea lanterns. Um, what? What can I bring? It? Oh, this have to be in a crafting interface here. Uh, yeah, sea lanterns, which you need prismarine shards and prismarine crystals, which those fish drop. Which makes that, and if you're not familiar with that, that's one of my favourite lighting blocks. At least it was until we got these lanterns. But it's a, a nice clean white light. A bit like glowstone, but prettier and cleaner and whiter. Not that there's anything wrong with not being... God damn it, I put all my food away. Back we go. Another smooth start to the day, guys. Always takes me a while to get back into the rhythm. <laughs> Wait, where did my fish go? Got a whole buttload of fish on me. Oh, I'll just take some chicken. Seriously, what did I... I must have put the fish back in the storage or something. Back in the farm. The quartz is the only block you can't turn back on its resource. Well, I mean, logs as well, I guess. Yeah. Oops. But yeah, I wish there was a, a good way to farm quartz. I mean, you can do a witch farm, but... They are kind of finicky. go to my new down below. I'm going to get the down below there, but I'm... I think I've got all the local quartz from that area, so we're going to go to the one that I made over here. Hey, you G-Man. Uh, yeah, just me. Alright, we need to be on the lookout for ghasts as well, because I do need more ghast tiers in order to... Um, respawn the dragon. Uh, are you? Oh, here we go. You're over something. I don't think he dropped a ghast here. Uh, even if he did, how do I bloody well get down there? Still haven't got my shiny, no. Gave the shiny hunting a rest this weekend as we did some Lego live streams instead. Alright, quartz, 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 quartz. Good lord, this area is dangerous, isn't it? Uh, oh, there's some quartz. Not much of it, but some. Did I bring any? Did not bring any building blocks, did I? Alright, grab some of this. I do love an efficiency axe in the nether. What can I say? It's a blessing and a curse though, really. Wait, where'd that quartz go? There it is. Do I give up? No, I haven't given up. Just took a break. Because I mean, I didn't even plan on doing the LEGO streams, they just kind of occurred to us last weekend. And I thought, well, blood hell, I'll, uh, I'll try it out and see if it works. And if it does work, I'll make a more permanent camera setup for it, etc, etc, etc. Um, do I have... No, it's Silk Touch. Oh, there's Fortune on this, excellent. So that'll give us a little boost in the drop rates of our quartz. Lovely. Might as well take a quick poke around. Nope, no 
more. Where's my pillar? Which one is my pillar? Here it is. <laughs> G-Man, thank you for the 400 bit of rooties. All right, quartz, quartz, quartz. How many do we get? We got 17 off those few blocks there. Thank you for, bloody hell, that looks dramatic, doesn't it? Is that, no. I should probably leave a trail. Oh, there's some quartz over there. Uh, Trying to accidentally create a new flow of lava that's going to kill me. I think we survived it. Hooray! <clears throat> I've actually been trying out a mod for 1.14 that adds a mining laser to the game. Being able to mine from a distance is handy. Uh, so is that an actual mod or a data? Oh, it would be a data pack, wouldn't it? Because Forge has not been updated past 1.12 at this point, has it? And they're not going to. So data pack, I presume. I don't know how I feel about that. Most of the data packs I use are convenience or quality of life thing just to make the stream flow a bit better like the bonzo thing so I don't have to spend hours upon hours of stream time mining trees or having to do that off stream even but yeah mining laser I don't know I feel like that's a little bit further outside the spirit of the game as far as my personal tastes go sounds cool though Did I? I did just see some quartz ray. I was about to complain. Uh, wait, Forge has been updated? I thought they weren't going to bother updating it for 1.14. I thought they would just... Nope, we're done. That changes things. was made aware. Like I said, they just decided not to bother. Too hard. Too much work. Got better things to do. <clears throat> when did all this happen? Was this a recent thing? I mean, of course it's recent. Because 1.14 is recent, but I mean super recent. As in the last week or so. There, by looks of things. A little bit down there. Alright, is it worth trying to go get that? I guess we could path through there. Hey, piggy. Oh, here's some. I'm being trepidatious because I know there's a big fall right here. I wasn't needing any gas. You can be guaranteed I'd be being peppered by one right now, couldn't wouldn't you? Never appear when you actually need them to. Uh, 
Uh, don't have a gold farm yet, no. Haven't really needed one, but I usually do make one at some point because, well, they're fun. Uh, but I might wait until 1.15 for that as well, because at the moment, in 1.14, you can't make a nether portal above the ceiling of the nether. In 1.15, that ability has been brought back. I don't know whether they accidentally patched it out, or they patched it out and too many people complained, but... They brought it back. You can build a nether portal on the ceiling of the nether again in 1.15. Making pig farms, aka gold farms, a lot more practical again. There's some over there. Ooh, careful. Two and a bit stacks so far. Not bad. <coughs> is it 1.15 out? Sure is. But as I said a moment ago, I haven't upgraded to it yet because Optifine is not available for 1.15, which means I can't run my beautiful ray tracing shader here. And quite frankly, I've gotten a bit addicted to it, and regular Minecraft looks hideous to me right now. <laughs> Will you sod off? Sod off! Sod off! I want to fucking swing my axe! Jesus. Really too much to ask? He was begging to be punched. Just through here. Aside from more drama. Plus the shadow might not be useful in 1.5 for a while. Um it should be fine. I mean the actual graphics engine hasn't dramatically changed 1.14 to 1.15, which is what the delay was for 1.13 for Optifine, because they rewrote the uh, render core. Uh, so the update should be fairly straightforward. We won't have to wait too long. And the shader itself, even though it wasn't approved for 1.14, it still works straight away in 1.14. And we moved from 1.13 anyway, so I'm not too worried about that. Hopefully we don't have to wait too long now. Because I would like to portal on the ceiling and I would like to play with bees. And I would like the new uh, world rendering engine to kick in so everything renders in nice and smooth. There's a nice little area right here. I wonder if it's still going to be this open when they... Uh, when 1.16 comes around and they redo the nether. I don't know whether they're going to change the world generation or just insert biomes. If they change the generation itself when I reset the nether, this open area might not be here. But if they don't, we can always come back here and start our nether base in this area. If that's indeed what we're going to do when 1.16 comes and brings with it all that beautiful new nether gizmos. Alright, what have I got? Three and a, three and a bit stacks. That should be enough for our needs. Let's go find our way back. I wonder if you'll be able to bring bees through into the nether. Oh shit! Are 
lit like you're over lava. Oh, do that. Gotcha. But if you did drop anything, it just burnt up because I wasn't paying attention. God fucking damn it. <clears throat> Bitch. I'm more concerned not, about it not being over a lava lake. I forgot about the pool from the stream. Didn't seem like he dropped anything any, anyway. I didn't see anything fall. Uh, oh, I missed a few bits here. back here, just in case we miss some easy bits. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Back we go to make some observers. change around 1.13 I feel like updates come crazy fast well I mean 1.14 and 1.15 is it's literally the first time different. we've had two major updates within the same year since I think 1.17 and 1.16 came within the same year or might have been before that even but yeah it has been quite some time since we've had two major updates so close together I mean busy bees isn't a huge update it does add features, so it still counts as a major update, but, you know, it didn't add a brand new biome or, or shit like that, like the, the previous updates have done for the last few big ones, where we got uh, ocean monuments and, 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 and woodland mansions and, uh, you know, all that crazy new stuff we got in the last few updates. Or brand new water physics and shit like that. Stuff. Let's get rid of this. Right, so I need cobble and redstone. Yeah, that's it. Zoop. And that was it. I got 29 more. That should be enough. Forty-eight extra if we use all of those. Hmm. I guess it depends on how much room I have to work with. I haven't even checked that really yet. That'll be a start, though. If we need more, we just need more redstone, which is much easier to find than quartz. Right. Refresh on the pistons. We need iron. Oh, shit. We do need more redstone. Okay. Well, then. Into the mines we go. Haven't been mining on stream in a while, have we? Don't enjoy playing Minecraft, like if I watch a stream for three years almost, and I don't enjoy playing it. <laughs> oh well, at least you like watching it. 
Or at least you like watching me play it, I guess. I don't know. You watch anyone else play Minecraft or is it just me? Uh, I should have bought more torches. God damn it. Hella pretty. Even though I've seen it several times. I mean, it's yeah, it's crazy nice. I love the caustics under it too. I really like to dance through the surface and reflect on it. It's so nice. And in the new update to the uh, shader that we got last weekend, clouds reflect in the water too. I never used to do that, which is. Making the water look extra nice. Uh, torch, torch, torch. He says, right, watch stream, maybe, and he watches you. Awesome. That's why I asked. I've exhausted both those lines. I'll try another one about here. A good little fade out effect when a block disappears in the shader. I haven't noticed that before. Redstone! Twenty already. Hopefully, we find some diamonds on the way here as well. Desperately need more diamonds. Let's go back there. Yeah, I'm not too. I'm not con too concerned about the ores. So of copper, uh, some iron back there. Obviously, we don't need that. Twitch your starter money. Not sure they're close to calling Twitch support and healing them. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad I don't have quite the trouble you guys do. Turn my main light down a bit here. I'm squinting into it. It's starting to really give me some strain. Seems a bit sensitive to it today. Mine, 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 mine. Alrighty then. I guess I'm not doing any mining. I guess I'm going back to the graveyard. Stream is fine, like every year. <laughs> Man, I must always watch in a browser. Uh, wait, where am I going? That was autopilot moment there. Thank you for fixing my lights, by the way. Do, 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 do. 
Rearrange my lights again. I might put the key light on that side instead. So I might actually look at the game screen. I'm looking into a light. Alrighty. Scaffolding. Gold brick. Away we go. There's a nice view from up here. Could've used a couple more. Rest ah not hungry enough for a spec chicken. Never mind. We'll wave it at it. Nope. And that. Stop it. Why can't I have stop placing torches? so much fun so if you clicks well I gotta have the habit of putting a torch in your fan so I keep forgetting So what was I doing? Oh, redstone. We need more. Oh, we should have enough redstone by now. We'll check. Right. What was I doing with the redstone? I was pistons. I need more pistons. Is what I needed. And I'm missing iron and planks. Oh man, even my iron supplies have dragged. Should have spent some time at the iron farm. Alright. 38, so. We need at least 40, 45 ish. Site. You go in the other side box. And the side. Nobody wants you. Stop trying to hang on. Okay, let's see. We got those. We got those. We got those. Gonna need the glass. Dirt to plant it on. Observers. We've got some blocks to build with. Don't need the rest of that. I can stay here. 
Um, and of course we're going to need a little bit of bamboo to actually plant the farm. Alright, I'm pretty sure we can make a start now. Let's go expand the bamboo. Oh, wait. Uh, I remember what else I needed. I'm going to need... Crap. Crappity crap crap. over at the farm. Don't know why, but I'm craving pizza. Oh, it's in now. now I am. That's it. Today's stream's only an hour long. I need to go get pizza. I'm not even kidding. As soon as I saw the word pizza, I just had an instant Pavlovian reaction. I want a big saucy pepperoni pizza. Uh, fuck me. That's a horrifying sound. <laughs> Oh, wait, I should get some sponges in. Yeah, I think we might have to do some clear up before we actually build the rest of the... The idea is to... I was going to wrap these around the, the wall, but then I remembered I had a door here. We might just make a... a bunch of farms in here and pipe them into the visible part. Where are my sponges at? Spongy, spongy. Oh, good. Cool. We do have a little more iron here for making extra hoppers. But it does look like I used the very last of my hoppers. Shiza. Bloody hell. That's a problem. Might do what we can do. Uh, I'm going to put that furnace. Thank you for the follow, by the way. I must have taken the furnace back with me. I did have a furnace down here. But when I swapped it out for the smoker, I must have left... Fine, okay, whatever. Didn't need to. I thought I was going to take more supplies than I did. Leaving the shocker behind was not an accident. And I'm just staring at the dominoes. I watched a little video of the 
See what I do like about the Domino's app. And the website for that matter does the same thing. You can track the driver or delivery guy, more often than on a little electric bicycle these days. Um, so you can see exactly where they are, where they're being held up, how far away they are. It's nice. I wish couriers did that, but I guess there's more of a security concern with live tracking of a courier carrying valuable stuff around. But I love being able to see exactly where my delivery guy is. Um, so yeah, I didn't need any of this for the shopper thing. God damn it, I'll just, I'll just make another thing. I'll just make another one, shall I? I'll just make one. Fine. What I should do is No, never mind. So Blag is full of water. Half full. It's full of water up to his waistline. He filled it with fish. There's a coral reef at his feet too. Can't see from here. Yeah, the uh, top half of Blag, the shirt, the head, and the arms are air filled. Crystal Blag. I can't wait to find out uh, what kind of new nether blocks we're going to wind up with with the nether update, because of course we're going to have to do a nether blog at some point, now that we have a bunch of different color options for nether blocks coming. That'll be the next blog, I've already decided. Hellblarg. Hmm, that was laggy. Right. Now then. Wet sponge. Become dry sponge. Dirt so I can seal off these rooms temporarily to make them easy to dry out. Bingo. for delivery as we speak. Fucker! Um, I don't even know whether I want to put the bamboo furnace there. I kind of like that little room. I like the layout. Then again, I guess we don't need it. We got a little, we got a little room back here we can be cute with if we need to. Let's hollow it out. Ten sponges in a room. It's all about positioning and understanding the range of a sponge, and that's why I sealed off the room when I came in here. The dirt there between these two rooms, so it was a smaller area. If you parcel off the areas you're drying out, and are judicious about where you place the sponges, it becomes a little bit easier. But yeah, I used to be like that too. You'd put down 20 sponges to clean out a room this size, and you'd still be left with a puddle. Uh, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. We've got room for about twenty call it twenty-five farms if we do all four walls. Will an extra twenty-five be enough, I wonder. Otherwise, 
What's beyond this? Oh, we don't have a lot of extra room back there because we're at the edge of the back wall, but we can push it out a little bit. Oh, no, we can't. Damn it. Yeah, I guess we could go down. Uh, I'll push it down. How much room do I need height wise? One, two, three, four. Okay. This is getting a slightly trickier than I anticipated. ceiling is all right. All right. Oh, and that's where we start to taper down, so that's our limit there. Apologies, Spanish speaker. I do not speak Spanish. I... No, barely enough to recognize that that is probably Spanish. Uh, no comprende, senor. But then I'd have to elevate the collection because I want to pipe straight into here. And with hoppers you can go down easy enough, but bringing, bringing stuff back up again would require, uh, you know, a bubble stream and all that kind of stuff, which, you know, we can do easy enough, but I would rather avoid that just to keep things simple. So I think instead what we might do is... Let's just carve out all the ceilings, so I just get an idea about how much room we've got to work with here. We need to go up to that level, so carving out that does mean no good. So, uh, call it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Hmm. How deep do we need? One, two, three, four, five deep. One, two, three, four, five. That brings us out to there. I guess we. Ah, this is not working out how I pictured it. <laughs> and we can't go this way, can we? Oh, we might be able to actually wrap around the back as well, by the looks of things. We do have room enough back here, although we don't have the height. Oh, 
Alright, let's just build what we can in this space and see what happens. Side is, ah, I forgot. Oh, God, I've done it all backwards again. Forgot how much I hate placing observers. Fantastic things, but it's such a pain in the ass to place. Uh, so let's, yeah, I'll just do it this way. somehow? Oh, but I forgot the redstone. <laughs> Idiot. I seriously forgot the redstone, haven't I? I haven't even brought it with me. Bloody hell. Man, you'd think I'd never played this game before. What am I building? I'm currently building an extension to the bamboo fuel farm. Which fuels the smoker which cooks the fish from the guardian farm. Getting a medium, hand tossed pepperoni mushroom pizza, and top wings and two little cook. That sounds fucking blissful right about now, I've got to tell you, mate. Oh, bloody hell! Look at this! Full on zombie horde! I haven't seen this happen in forever! Forgot it was even a thing that could happen! Bloody hell. Look out, Mr. Villager. You're in trouble. You're in super duper big trouble. Ow. Bloody hell, there's so many of them. A villager. Good for you. Man, I literally, I, I, I can't even remember the last time I had to actually face a horde. Last time it happened was, I don't even know if it happened in this world at all. But it was, it happened like in a in a wild village, and I just left it, I just left them to their own devices. This one. What the? How did the arrow go clean through his head? Axe. Oh, that was 
exciting. I was, I was nearly done anyway. Whatever. Now, we better check on the village. I don't think any made it through. And even if they did, we've got so many iron golems hanging about these days. He seems pretty calm. Not seem very. Oh, there we go. There's some villagers. All right, we should be fine. Do, 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 do. Got to say, food delivery is the next best thing to slice bread. Can you? I guess you can get slice bread delivered because there are grocery delivery services, aren't there? Experience. Mm -hmm. Oh, geez. Man. It's all the mobs. The helmet got all dinged up. Effects also deliver baked goods. Nice. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm definitely gonna have to get pizza tonight. I really, I really, I really shouldn't. The budget doesn't allow for it. Oh, but then again, you know what? Skull Kid's already given me 20 bucks worth today. That's enough for a delivery pizza. Buy me some pizza, Ray. That's what you're doing. Literally burnt every cent of my previously almost kind of maybe disposable money income uh, on Lego. I really shouldn't have spent that either, to be honest with you guys. Power bills overdue, rents overdue. Very irresponsible. Right, now we should be firing. There we go. Do, 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 do. And grab those. Now, let me think about... We don't need to glass this part up either. We can just straight up lock this in. Right, and now we need to do one on this side as well. You know what? I'm going to leave this room empty. This is a bit of a squeeze in here. I might try the back-to-back -back thing. Let's go get those sponges. Okay, 
so let's see ourselves off here. Still got the height issue on this side as well. God damn it. I got the uh, NASA Apollo 11 lunar lander to go to my certain V. Nice. Uh, what, like a. What, what, like, oh, what like, did I get? Well, the ones we've been streaming the last couple of days. A few little Star Wars kits and a little uh, London Bus Creator kit. Jeez, you scared me, Pigman. Thought you were an actual threat there for a second. Right, um... Yeah, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just out of room. Buggeration. Even less room than I thought I had. Right then, I guess I won't be using this room for that. I am going to have to do the bubble stream thing after all, aren't I? Gonna have to go down a level and bubble up fuel to this, which is pain in the ass. I'm not even gonna worry about it at this stage, actually. I'm gonna have a bigger think about exactly how I wanna do this. It's not it's not emergency need right yet. something about that. Which part is it? Why am I so confused? Is it that block? Where's that block? That's better. There's so much lag getting into my chest. Oh, you... Never mind. That's fine. Whatever. That's fine. It's perfectly fine. <sighs> oh, wait. Can I fix it from this side? Gonna behave if I do it this way. Why? 
On what planet did you think I meant to do it that way, Minecraft? Will, you sod off! What is your issue getting in my fucking way all the time? Goddamn pigmen. Again, under what rule of law do you think I meant to do that? Where'd the second one go? I had two stairs, right? Here it is. Right now I can't even get to it. I want so little from life. That's all I wanted to do. Fine. Now then, we have slightly more bamboo. Oh, Jesus. That's got me. Oh, that was from my restock there. Yeah, still not coming in very fast. Minecraft is denoted. Enjoy the pizza. Minecraft itself is denoted. Thank you. I guess we're gonna have to get a Minecraft crate now. It's weird. Is it always night time? It's way more night time than there should be. Check the spelling. Oh, it's Minsraft. There's a callback. From the charity stream like two years ago. That packs. Makes me want to get one too. Sure, don't you? Well, who, nobody ever needs pizza. Pizza's not about need. Why are there so many mobs around today? Look at this. They're everywhere. Draft, and we need a piece of dye for the sign. Uh, let's put it over here. Some. Do we have a, another comedy grave over here somewhere? I think. Oh, oh yeah, there's Dory. We'll put it opposite Dory. Okay. Rest in pepperoni pizza mince raft and when you think about it that's kind of what a pizza can be if you have ground beef on it it's a mince raft it's a raft for mince thank you did the new bedrock update just kill my mob farm which mob farm are you talking about but probably yes Just bedrock. Mob farms never work properly in bedrock. TSM Mythic, hello there. That is going alright. The Minecraft stuff isn't going to plan, but aside from that, it's going alright.
Alright, now, how do I want to do the rest of this bamboo? Let's see. Oh, actually. We don't actually need any more hoppers. We can do the entire supplementary beds with water streams going into a bubble stream. Oh, that's how we're going to do it. Pump it. Pump a water stream into that. From Yeah, I think I've got a plan. Alright, let's uh Yep, yep, yep. I think we can do this. Okay, let's get drying. That I'll get you. Pizza person on the way there. I am shades of jelly. Think, 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 think very carefully about what you're doing here, buddy. That's annoying. I really didn't want a big room back here. Just want to the corridor. Sex, but I have a scared uh, pink sheep. Did you mean sacred pink sheep? Because they're rare. Or if you put it next to a wolf, keep it scared. Sacred, I thought you might have been sacred. So we need to end a water stream here. To bubble up. It gives us a fair amount of room to work with, I guess. here as well so we can probably carve out the ceiling to get us the extra height we might need here 
All right, it is actually coming together again. What's that? Oh, we should be careful about that because that's part of the sorting system. stream here. Let's go ahead and... Where's my dark prism ring gone? I don't have much dark prism ring. Alright. I'm going to use Latins. Alright, so my thought process now that it's coming together is we'll put a stream... Put a stream through the middle here. It'll flow this way into a bubble stream, which will inject our crops into the hopper collections of the rest of it, and put a piston harvester system on either side. So both sides are pushing into the middle where it's collected in the stream and then harvested. That's the plan. that. Let's see here. If we... Yeah, we can make... We can make, we can make, we can make ground level planting there. Which means we want the pistons there. And the observers will have to come in from the other side to do that. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this should work. Four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, nine. So it's another. Another 18 farms piled up there. Plus we could probably do it the other direction as well and bring them back into here if we need even more. I do have some salt sand here still, don't I? I should do. That's a big negatory. Could have sworn I had some. Oh, it might be in that box. Yeah, it is. Alright, anything else I need while I'm here? Don't need the slime, don't need letters. Hit signs, no, no, no. Okay. I do. Oh, I've got the glass. to pop these out. I don't remember whether bamboo grows by the word light or not. Many crops do, so I'm just going to do that. Except no I won't because I want to sink that down a level if I'm going to do the water stream. Think, then do. Think then do. Order of operations. Quite important. Uh, 
food to you. Nice. That didn't take long. On a scale of one to stop the stream and order some pizza, how good is it? Crap. Alright, that'll be our bubble stream. Zerp. The old zerp and flurp. I'm thinking about the water that's going to need to push it in. We could go all the way up, push it in so it drops down. That'd be kind of cool. I don't know. We'll figure something out. See, we might have to sacrifice. Yeah. Otherwise, the water stream is going to get all kinds of pain in the arsery. So, okay. We'll lose one there. if we only need this kind of height, we can actually push forward through here, can't we? Yeah, we sure can. We've got lots of room back here. Okay, cool. So let's just get ourselves. So where's my bucket? There it is. Bucket. Think, then do. a couple of these with ice so they go a little bit better. Oops. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah. Think then do. I don't have any ice with me here, but that's fine. Let's just get this bamboo growing in the meantime. So it'll take a while to kick in. And observers, thank you. Smart to dry this out. Which is easy enough to do. We might not have sufficient sponges for this though. I think we got away with it. Look how good I am at Minecraft. What are my festive plans? Don't have any. I only really do the Festivus thing. Haven't done since I was about... God, fuck me. I think it was about 25 last time I did a proper Christmas. Alright, if we're going to do that, we 
might as well carve out all of this at this point. What about your Lego first time gift? What? Oh, the, the old Batman. I don't think I've got that queued up anymore. I think it's been a couple of years since I've had that ready to go. Let me check. These. No, it's definitely not on the stream deck. Yeah, we should bring that back. Now that we're doing the Lego streams. For those who are confused by that, you know in the, in the first Lego movie, where Batman's throwing the batarangs at the, uh, the button to open the door or whatever it was? Um... That aquas the water. Uh, yeah, he throws like 20 of them and finally gets it. And he just goes, first time. We used to have that as a GIF for the stream. I should bring that back. Um, I'll just use... Actually, no, we... I really shouldn't use prismarine for the redstone block because I need to know if I'm about to break it from below or something. Alright. And... Zip, zip, zip. Uh, where's a safe place to go get some water from so without washing away that stuff? Excuse me, excuse me, thank you. Alright, looks like the harvesting's already working. Um, I am going to need a sign to hold the water back from the bubble stream. Sure, I've got some left because when I built the sorting system. No, but I've got a trapdoor. That'll do just as well. Oh, that this signs. Suddenly dawned on me what I've done wrong here. Now I'll look at the chat to see if someone was warning me about that. Fatal floor. Yeah, Skull Kid noticed. Will you be watching the Witcher? I will, yeah. I was uh, I was going to watch it last night. I wanted to watch the Lego Movie 2 first. By the time I was done with that, I was like, you know what? Eh, I'm not going to watch it yet. But yeah, I do intend to watch it. I'm not a, I'm not a Witcher fan. I mean, I don't hate it. The only Witcher game I've ever played is Witcher 3. And while I appreciate what other people like about it, it just never appealed to me because I thought the combat was <sighs> clumsy. It just wasn't fun. But I did like everything else about it, but playing it as a game, just kind of... I didn't quite get there with it. Looking forward to checking out the series. I'm hearing good to mixed reviews. I haven't heard anyone say they think it's complete trash yet. Most people are somewhere between it's okay and it's actually pretty good. Uh, I'd be interested to see what my opinion will be on it because most people I've heard talk about it so far are indeed Witcher fans, either from the games or the books or both. So me not having a depth of knowledge on either the books or the games uh, will have a slightly different perspective. Mm. 
and many people do. Chest is not going to interfere with the observer, is it? Data minus two minus three. Yeah, I mean, I've got. Actually, let me check Steam real quick. How many hours in that do I have? Steam library. Oh Christ! I still can't get used to the new library. Uh, which are three wild hunts? I have. Eight hours playtime. Probably at least half of that is benchmarking for GPU reviews. <laughs> Actually, no, it's, it's, it's probably less than half. I reckon my actual playtime would be maybe five hours. And I, yeah, I, like I, I kept bouncing off the combat, so I just kind of gave up on it. But yeah, made a very good game for benchmarking because it is very, very pretty and lots of people play it and it's, you know, it, it, it behaves consistently as you want a benchmark game to, to behave uh, through different hardware. But yeah, mostly when I'm benchmarking, I'm not actually playing the game, I'm just sort of riding about or walking through a forest and shit like that. Okay, let's make sure this works. Sure does. I mean, we are going to have a little bit of loss here, as always happens with farms like this, but not too concerned about that. I wonder if we're going to have an issue. Oh, they're not going to bounce that far. Right, zoop. And um, probably gonna want to help. <laughs> Alright. that one there, but whatever. I watched the first two eps, didn't like it so far. Yeah, I wanted to, uh, like I said, when I was going to watch it last night, I decided I was too tired. I've done that backwards, haven't I? I always forget which way to place observers. I put those blocks there so I could place the observers, but I realized I have to place the blocks on the other side, because, yeah, every time. I'm not alone, right? You guys always also forget which way observers have to face, right? Everyone does it, I'm sure. Right, um, as I, yeah, well, I was just saying, too tired to watch. I mean, I could have got through an episode or two last night pretty easily. But with shows like that, that are designed to be potentially bingy. I'd like to sort of carve out enough time and energy to make sure that if I get caught up in it, um, I've got time and, and alertness to watch five episodes at least. So yeah, I'll give it another go tonight. house recently. Yeah, I've gone through a house maybe five times over the years. I really like it. I'm probably coming close to needing uh, another rewatch of it. It's been a while. But at the moment, I'm still going through Stargate SG-1 when I'm uh, 
done with that. Actually, before I'm done with that, uh, I'll be doing Atlantis. I don't know whether I'll go episode to episode so it emulates the old week to week thing because they don't cross over that actively. But I think I'll start watching Atlantis when it was time to, you know, when the original kickoff happened. But I'm coming real close to where Atlantis actually starts. I don't know if I'll rewatch Universe. I did rewatch that quite recently. But yeah, once I'm done with SG1 and Atlantis, maybe then it'll be time for House again. Nicely. Uh, I do need to go get some ice. Ba -ba 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 signage to hold back the water stream. Um, I need kelp as well so I can make these source blocks the easy way. Be able to poke through this wall here. No. This one. There we go. Do, 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 do. Kelp. Help! Help, kelp! Place the salt. I don't think kelp can grow on salt. Did I manage not to pick up any kelp then at all? Really? How did I, how did I manage not to pick up any kelp? Some that time. Yeah, the cup won't grow on soul sand with it. Right, um, think, think, think. How do you want to do this exactly? If you... Should work, right? If we put a sign there, that shouldn't interfere with the harvesting. It will stop the water. Actually, 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 actually. Uh, is that going to work? Hopper going to be enough to catch it from there? Or am I going to have to sacrifice one of these? Right, that should work. Plant kelp on soul sand. 
your car. Yeah, okay. Didn't think so. What the? Oh, man. Such a good ass. So as that kelp grows, that'll make all that water source blocks, which will then trigger the bubble column, which will then make our crap float up into the collection system. Meanwhile, we need to go back to base to get some ice to help those water flow properly. Or well, the items flow over properly. He doesn't like it. I was absorbed in business there. Didn't see you come in. Spicy foods when depressed idea works. Hooray! I was feeling depressed earlier. Made some beef ramen. Added sweet habanero sauce to it. It's hot, hot, hot. Good. Glad that's working for you. Always nice to have a non-drug related tool in the belt. Where am I? That's weird. Is that another zombie horde? Or was it just a couple of zombies close together? Right, what have I done with my ice? Here it is. Got packed. Excellent. Except I'm all out of room here. I'm all jammed up. Um, 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 um. I'm going to take my break now. We're eight minutes overdue. Now's a good time for it. Just while we wait. All right, so I'm going to be a couple of minutes, guys. Have a stretch. Grab a fresh coffee. Oh. Yeah. Be our beast.